Welcome to Living Supernaturally. Welcome to this edition. This week we've been studying about our spiritual health. Today uh, we look at one more test or one more check to find out if we are doing okay spiritually. Just like how we can do several tests physically to find out if you're doing okay. Uh, here's one more test to find out if you're doing well spiritually. And uh, this test or this check is called the faith level check. How strong is our faith in God? How strong is our faith in His Word? Hebrews chapter 11 and verse 1 talks about how faith is the substance of things hoped for and the evidence of things not seen. And if we go down to verse 6, it says, But without faith, it is impossible to please Him. For he who comes to God must believe that He is and that he is a rewarder of those who diligently seek him. So we know that uh, we need to come to God in faith. We need to relate to him in faith. It is impossible to please him without faith. Now our faith uh, can be in, in a negligible level. Our faith can be underdeveloped or our faith can be very mature and it's our faith can be very, very strong in the Lord. But we need to have faith because it takes faith to believe that God is who He said He is. It takes faith to receive God's word and to follow through and obey His word and His instructions. It takes faith to pursue and fulfill the will of God, the call of God on our lives. And it also takes faith to stay on course or on the path that He has set for us uh, in spite uh, difficulties and challenges that we might have. So it takes faith to do all that. Um, you know, when we, when we see that uh, faith comes by hearing and hearing by the Word of God. So when we hear the Word of God, uh, when we take time to, uh, to receive the Word of God, then faith is birthed in our hearts. Um, fear, on the other hand, esteems God's word lower than our circumstances and our challenges. Whereas faith esteems God's word and His promises higher than our circumstances and the challenges. Today, if we are experiencing fear and hopelessness, uh, we need to ask ourselves, what is our faith confession? and the declaration, are we confessing fear and hopelessness or are we declaring God's word and His promises over ourselves and our circumstances? Shall we pray? Father, we thank you, Lord, that um, you've called us to have faith in you. Lord, your word says that when we come to you, that we must believe that you are who you said you are and that you are a, a rewarder of all those who diligently seek you. And today we pray and we ask, Lord, increase our faith. May our faith mature, Lord. May our faith be in you and in your promises. We thank you. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.